Okay, we turn now to a close call at Yellowstone National Park when a woman posing for a photo tried to touch a wild bison. Yep, Trevor Alt has the story. Hi, Trevor. Hi, Rebecca. Yes, yeah, sometimes we have obvious warnings, but we know a lot of people are taking summer vacations, and this is another good reminder. Animals are not photo props, and experts say this woman here and the people who were taking this photo were all very lucky, and they hope other people can learn from their mistake. <laughs> This morning, a close encounter and close call in Yellowstone National Park. Watch as this woman poses for a photo trying to touch a wild bison when it lunges for her as if preparing to charge. <laughs> that woman rushing away, tripping, as thankfully the bison stays back. It's part of what wildlife experts warn is a dangerous pattern at national parks. Well, what we see in this footage is just another example where people are losing their fear and more importantly, their respect for powerful animals, including in a place as prestigious and as important as a national park. This video shows another Yellowstone tourist getting dangerously close for a selfie. While this bison doesn't react, Yellowstone officials say there are usually multiple bison attacks each year. These creatures can weigh 2,000 pounds and run 35 miles an hour, easily tossing a human like a rag doll. Oh, no, no. Oh. Last year, this Texas woman trying to sneak by a bison was gored in the back, spending six days in the hospital. They've got that great mantle of horns, and the last thing you want to do is tangle with those horns. People have been killed by bison when they violate this creature's space. The bottom line, you can and should enjoy the wildlife, but from a safe distance using common sense. Get that amazing photo or video but also be careful, you're in their space. This is wild country. And officials say a bison in a national park requires at least 75 feet of space. If you're any closer than that, you're not just putting yourself at risk, you are also violating the law, although honestly, I think I would prefer prison to being gored by a bison. Mm. Yeah, good point. That's a tough call. I never, right? To be honest with you, Trevor, I've never thought about that. It's a lose-lose. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Trevor. <laughs> Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.